Hey Leos, this is your weekly reading for May 2022. Let's go ahead. Oh goodness. <laughs> These cards do not want to shuffle for me this morning. That's okay. We'll get it together. We're going to see what's going on with you guys here this week. I, I will tell you that I saw choices and decisions. This is the second time that I'm seeing it in new love. Okay. Let's see what comes out for you here later here for Leo. Messages here for Leo this week. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Got a yes and no. Okay. And then you have problems. <laughs> problems. What are these problems? We're going to explore this a little bit more here. I'm going to have to take that. Okay. What are the messages you have here for Leo? There we go. Okay, Leo, let's jump into your reading here. You guys have yes. What are you thinking about? Spirit is saying yes, okay? Possibly to growth here with the number 66 that's coming in. Your card is saying, what are you waiting for? The answer to your question is yes. Could this be love coming in or just uh, love for yourself or deeper uh, commitment towards you and what you are building here in your life? Maybe you guys need to focus on that this week, what you're building. You also have protection coming in. Your card is saying uncertainty lurks around you, but you are shielded by the powerful energy of heaven's light. Um, the, I'll clarify this. I just got something that just came into my head here. We'll address it. Okay. They're saying the happy birds sing you a song of hope, feel safe and have no worries. Uh, Mount Tai, the most sacred ancient mountain is here to support and tech protect you here. Leo, what is going on? <clears throat> Excuse me. What is going on here with Leo this week? Spirit what are you saying yes to? Something you guys are trying to explore, whether it is relationship, a new possibility, a new opportunity for yourself here. The answer is yes. And you're worried if you're going to have stability, if you're going to get what you um, are after here. Okay. They're saying you're going to have to put in work. It's you. You're going to have to put in the work. You guys have Knight of um, Wands coming in. You have the Page of Wands. So some answer is coming in towards you. And the answer is yes. Some message coming in. It's a very good message with the Page of Wands that is showing up for you. So good news is coming in. And the answer is yes to something that you are... Um, wanting or trying to pursue in your life here okay it may require you guys to travel i see new possibilities coming in possibly in purchasing something of significance here this week maybe you guys are thinking about purchasing a vehicle um, or going on a trip here you're wondering if you're going to be able to do this will you get time off the answer is yes here but there's something about travel some of you guys um modes of transportation that's what they're saying here maybe you guys need a car or you need your car fixed or you need to get a loner or something happened to your vehicle here this is real simple okay i feel like some good news is coming in towards you or you guys may get approved for some loan here that you guys are trying to get to purchase um a vehicle or something of significance whether it's a job or a vehicle um i feel like you're going to be moving forward here but for some reason like modes of transportation is really sticking out will you get the uh, the flight that you're trying to obtain here will you be able to set up all of your travel plans and it be go smoothly and successfully the answer is yes that's what i'm feeling here what are you waiting for get ready get ready to go on a trip get ready to purchase something of significance or get ready to move into a new position when it comes to your career or business in your life here okay they're saying yes 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 okay um, this feels good. <laughs> Leo, you have learned to say no. Oh, why? Okay. You got yes. And then you got no coming in. They're saying, say, saying no is a ha act of love. Saying no is an act of love. When we say a healthy no to an abusive situation, whether this is in response to another person or to ourselves, um, maybe this is you just thinking, 
um, like the answer is going to be no and spirit is saying stop putting that into the universe here okay stop putting that energy out prepare yourself for something new the answer is yes here maybe you're telling yourself no no I'm not good enough no that's not going to happen no that is not possible believe in miracles believe that things will move in the right direction for you that's the message that I'm getting they're saying we are uh, when you when you are setting limits and establishing healthy boundaries this is not self selfish here okay um i feel like they're saying that it's healthy it's not selfish okay it's healthy to set boundaries for yourself here um whether that is uh, boundaries you're setting on your own uh beliefs and what you're working towards or setting boundaries and relationships they're saying a healthy no is saying yes to life give your permission give yourself permission to say no you also have the way that is coming in towards you here leo you are in the right place at the right time stay grounded avoid extremes because it could change mm -hmm. Okay, avoid extremes. So say no to extremes. That's what I feel like they're wanting you to do at this time. Okay, um, don't take too much risk here. Okay, um, I feel like your success that's coming in is not by chance, it's because you put in a, hard, a lot of hard work, but it could be fleeting if you are just um, living on the extremes. Okay. Or accepting extremes avoid extremes because it could change abandon false praise and people will be truthful shun formality and people will be sincere forsake cleverness and people will be kind to each other so what's going on with these problems so you guys may be experiencing some problems here you know you need solutions to don't go and do anything extreme here spirit is saying you're on the right track and something is going to pull through for you that is your message this week your card is saying um, this card asks you to review or to view any problems as an opportunity rather than a crisis let's say that again this card asks you to view any problems as an opportunity rather than a crisis whenever we identify a problem our very um, recognition and acknowledgement of this difficulty creates an opportunity to seek a potential solution so they're wanting you to seek a potential solution here okay <laughs> don't go to extremes as long as a problem remains unseen or indeed denied the doorway to a potential solution remain closed here okay and they're calling you a free spirit so they're saying go for it here um something that you're wanting here in your life but Again, I don't know why they keep saying this. Don't do anything extreme, but uh, be organized here. I feel like they're saying be organized and going towards your dreams here, okay? Um, chart a plan or put together a plan to um, succeed at um, something that you're after here. They're wanting you to get organized. I just keep hearing that, but they're saying go for it. Signs of good fortune are all around you here, Leo. You're... <laughs> you race off again fearlessly like the uh, Knight of Wands that's showing up here to a new level of achievement and success. Your intelligence and resourcefulness empowered by heavenly inspiration will take you far. Remember to take a break though, okay? When you need one. Let's see it. what else is going on for you guys here this week. So they're saying say no to extreme, say yes to healthy and well thought out, thought out solutions. If I can get my words together for you guys. Healthy and well thought out solutions to your problems here. And you will be successful. Look at that. Look at how you guys are showing up. Okay, it does feel very inviting. You guys want the best. Oh. But you will be tempted to, to do some extreme things here. Uh, that's what I'm seeing, okay, this week. You will be tempted. But they're saying stand your ground here, okay? Say no to unhealthy people, unhealthy situations. Say no to things that you know you should not be involving yourself in. Say no to extremes, okay? And I'm going to say that. You're going to like, how many times are you going to say that? It just is sticking with me, okay? You guys may be feeling like you want to cut corners in doing something. That's what that energy kind of feels like here this week. And Spirit is saying, don't do that, 
okay that's not going to get you uh closer to your goal here okay whatever you guys are trying to uh achieve but do protect yourself as well from any temptations i'm seeing in the future here uh leo you will be dealing with some temptations you will be tempted to do some things that may not work for you in the long run here okay don't take um i feel like they're saying don't take unnecessary risk unnecessary risk there's nothing wrong with taking a risk in your risk in your life but if it's extreme and unnecessary like all it takes is for you to be patient and work through a problem or work through solving a problem here um they're wanting you to um do that be patient here okay but the seven of wands that is crossing you could work against you here if you are uh too adamant on on remaining on one path here they're wanting you to seek solutions here okay um possibly even do something differently say no to um your your mind wanting to um cut corners okay say no to that uh, for some reason that it's coming up for you guys okay i feel like it won't get you to the success that you are looking for here okay um you guys may be uh i'm gonna go a little deeper here i feel like you guys may be wanting to um they're telling me about some job i'm finna go real deep this may not apply for anybody uh to all of you guys okay but i feel like some of you guys want to get references from people here okay that that you really did not do work for or you want to uh create something or or put something together that is not true I'm not saying you guys are liars okay but you're trying to falsify something that's what they're saying to me but they're saying don't do this because it's going to backfire on you okay um like if you're trying to go for a job and you're saying can i use you as a reference and you never work for that person or they're not really the owner of the company or you're trying to falsify some documents or you're trying to do something in the background to get you ahead i feel like it will work against you here for some reason this is coming up it's not the cars it's my intuition that is kicking in okay um they're not wanting you to cut corners they're wanting you to go to do things uh the right way here that's what's going to lead you towards success here you guys have the hermit card here in the past so i feel like you've been waiting for an opportunity and it will open up to you that's something else that i'm feeling i feel like a lot of you guys may have been withdrawn or very uh anti-social here in the past with the hermit card that is coming up in the past position here it's time to connect with other people uh people that are like-minded here that's another the message that's coming in towards you here leo okay so get back uh to working with people that are like-minded all right period you got the strength card that is uh grounding you right now at this moment so some very strong energy uh for you guys that i'm seeing coming in here they're wanting you to uh be patient when i told you to be patient <laughs> yes be patient okay and rely on your instincts here what is crowning you you want the best for yourself and your family you want happiness here you will get it okay spirit is saying you will be successful be patient do things the proper way so you don't have to clean up a mess in the future here okay i feel like the future is going uh towards the end of may here okay like you don't have to um explain why you did something um or lied on an application <laughs> or lied about something you don't have to clean that up if you're just being honest here i feel like whatever your dealings are you have to be honest about it here um in order to be successful uh that's what i'm feeling okay you have the page of cups that is showing up you also have the nine of cups that's showing up for you guys so it's some really uh great energy that i'm seeing coming in for you uh some wish that you have is going to be fulfilled you're going to be able to show off your creative side and a lot of people will love you and your energy and you will be very trustworthy as well if you take one a position of um honesty here that's uh, a message that's coming in towards you okay i feel like they're wanting you to walk away from people places and things that may have felt um 
like they were holding you back here. I see you guys trying to do this. I feel like that is your answer to um, move towards truth and move towards balance here with the Eight of Cups that is showing up for you. Move away from things that have drained you, okay? And um, they're also giving me this energy that you guys need to focus inward here as well to figure out or to find out the people that you need to say no to these are the people that you need to say no to okay <laughs> the seven of swords energy that is coming in here i feel like that is that future temptation here people telling you well you could do it this way and this will work for you i did it this way but if they're still not in a in a position of success in their life and they're still struggling that way did not work for them and it probably will not work for you okay i know this reading is kind of coded for you guys but i'm definitely feeling like you should um it's just this big message here that you should do things the right way the first time so you don't have to go back and clean up a mess here okay so be honest when you're talking to people about applications do not try to get false documentations don't try to uh, fool someone or trick someone not saying that you guys would do this but if you even thought about it I'm not gonna lie I probably <laughs> try to do that as well with some jobs like can you be a reference for me no don't don't do that okay because I feel like it will come back at some time to haunt you I don't know if you guys ever saw that meme or what was it a video when someone was talking about yeah I've done that job before and they've not never done it and you get the position okay and they want you to do this job and you have no idea how to do it here okay I feel like that is a situation that you may be faced with so make sure that you're being crystal clear and honest so you can have the best result in the end here whatever you're dealing with whether it is something that you're going towards uh, getting a vehicle trying to get a loan trying to get a job here they're wanting you to be honest and put the truth on paper or deliver the truth to whoever is trying to seek out information here okay it will solve your problems as well in the long run here okay that was kind of a coded message but this is your message of success okay like spirit is saying there are signs of fortune all around you okay and you're going to be off again fearlessly to a new level of achievement and success in your life your intelligence and resourcefulness okay empowered by heavenly inspiration will take you far remember to take a break when needed leo that is your reading you guys take care of yourself and i will see you in your next reading bye